Hi guys, I'm back and we are going to do Sly Cooper. So I'm going to get started and I'm going to start in the background. I think I'm gonna do the background gray. I have, I, um, I'm just gonna get some of my black and some of my white and I'm just gonna kind of mix a fun mixture of gray. And um, I don't want it super dark because he's got a lot of black in him. I'm just gonna make it kind of like a streaky fun background that has a little bit of colors throughout. We kind of try to keep it to where the streaks show, so we don't want anything solid here, especially because it's going to go against all the solid black, okay? I hope everybody's doing good. I'm having a great day. Enjoying the paintings and all that good stuff. Okay, so I'm just going to continue and fill in all the background. And I'm just going to go around over here. Sorry, I'm fighting my camera. I'm trying to go around it. I thought it was high enough, but I guess I was wrong. Make sure once again there's some light in it because we don't want it to be super dark so I'm gonna go back in because that color right there was getting a little bit too too dark for my liking and I don't want it to be against the black or too dark with the black we want the black to stand out so I'm just gonna kind of go in with some white and just blend it all in okay down here. I'm just going to kind of mess with it. Okay, so I have some memberships available if you're not in any of them. Um, you can message me and ask me. We have tutorials every Friday in the kids one, tutorials every Friday in the adults one. So they're a lot of fun and I'm gonna, once I get things all situated, I'm gonna start going live a little bit in there and um, so that'll be fun but right now I'm just trying to build things and get everything going so the, um, it all takes a lot of work and stuff to get everything the way I need it to be so but once I do get all that settled and stuff I'm going to definitely go in and and do some fun lives and stuff like that so it'll be fun it'll be a lot of fun so I'm just gonna continue to do that kind of go in here just like I said around around it with some more white just to give it a lighter okay just like that it's okay if we go in the lines a, a little bit because that's all black right there I'm pretty sure okay so you just keep messing with it and do it however you like however you feel looks good to you I hope it's not too glary. I'm not sure where the glares are at right now. It's hard to tell, so I hope I'm not glaring you out. So, just keep messing with the background, but I think I'm pretty much done with that part. I add a little bit of streaks over here. Just like that, okay? And maybe a little bit more wider on this edge. 
I say that and then I added black to it and turned gray. Some little highlights around. Just to kind of give it Okay, so now that that's done, I'm gonna go in with the black. Okay. And actually, I made a huge mistake and that was not black on the outside. That is actually white, but we're gonna do a black um, outline, so we're good. We'll go around and do black around the whole thing. Now this part is all white under here, okay? So uh, make sure to keep that white. So above this area, all the way to here, we're gonna do black and the eyes are going to be blue. So we're going to do those after. Okay, so now it's just filling all this in. All this area, we're gonna fill in all black. Okay. I'm actually going to cover that because we're going with the different patterns. You don't even have to worry about those lines. Okay, so all this area is going to be black. I kind of went in my line right there, but I'll figure, I'll fix that in a minute. I'm just trying to go on this camera. Okay, so I'm just filling all this area in. Okay. And just to avoid some of the streakiness, you might have to go back over it a couple times. Um, just to fill it in and make it look nice and full and not, you know, not super streaky. So, just keep filling all this in. all that in. Okay, I'm going to let that dry for a minute. I'm going to go in with my smaller brush and just do some little touch-ups on some edges. That I, sorry if my camera's wiggling. I'm going to go here. Just kind of clean up some of the lines with a more smaller liner brush. Just like Sorry about that. Just cleaning up some of this right here is all I'm doing. And then you can get your liner. And now we can go around our edge and do an outline. And the gray might still be wet in some areas, which is fine. Okay, we're just going to go around and outline them. Start down here and go up. Put the 
going to clean that up with my white, which I have to go in there with white anyway, so it's okay. Just going to make sure it's dry. Okay, I'm just going to finish off this lining down here. Once again, I'm going to go fill this all in with white, so if I have any to touch up, it's completely fine. I'm going to go here. Okay, now got that part done. I'm just gonna go back in with my larger brush again and make sure there's not too much water in it. And I'm gonna go back and fill some of this area in just to make sure there's not a lot of streaks and it's nicely filled in and all that good stuff. Okay. Okay. All right, so now we have that done. I'm gonna go back in with my tiny brush. I'm gonna do his little nose. I'm just filling this in is all. Okay. All right. Now what we're going to do is we're going to fill all the bottom area. Oops, make sure your brush is really clean. I don't want that to be black. It's okay if some of the bottom is black because it's maybe has a little tinge gray, but I think we're gonna probably pull enough black in here anyways because I know I'm not my black is not painted. I mean not dried, I'm sorry. But you can definitely um you can definitely blow dry yours or or wait for it to make sure there's not too much water because um, I had too much water in mine. And I'm just basically going in here and filling in this area and touching up some of those spots. If there's a little bit of gray that mixes, it's, it's fine. I mean, you don't want a lot. You can always see how that just blends right back in. Just rub it right back in there. Okay. I'm going to just fill all this in so we don't really even need these these lines after all. I'm just clean up some of those. This will probably have to have another coat as well because it's not we gotta cover those lines better. Okay, so I'm just going along and just cleaning up that edge on the bottom so it looks better. Might have to go back over that went too far down there. That's okay. I probably should have did the white first in all reality. Honestly, I should have probably did the white first, but that's okay. This has a little gray, which is fine. Down here can have a little gray. If we want it to, we certainly don't have to have it have gray. But I actually like the gray. And the shady kind of look is looks pretty cool just 
I'm actually going to keep it. <laughs> if you want this wider, you can have a wider. Some pictures, a lot of the pictures are different of this character, so. Um, I'm just gonna go with it. If you want it to be a little gray under here, then that's fine. If not, go over it again with some white. I'm keeping mine gray because I actually like it. And one of the pictures actually has gray, so works out good. I'm just gonna take it up a little bit and just kind of blend it to where it's not, just kind of blends and then kind of stops and turn, turns a little bit more, more um, white up there, okay? And then I'm gonna clean out my brush really good. I'm actually gonna use my small brush here, okay? Cause I'm gonna go in with my white and touch up some areas up here, okay? I don't really want this gray up here. Let's see if I have any spots here I want to touch up. I actually didn't even paint this yet, did I? I'm really just gonna touch up the, clean up my edges here. I'm gonna try not to make a mess. And once again, I have a little gray. If you don't want this gray shadowy color, then by all means, blow dry it or give yourself some time to um, let your painting dry, your black areas dry, okay? I, I like it, so I'm keeping it. I actually like, see, like this side has gray. Oops. It's too much gray. Um, I actually like it, so I'm going to try to pull it over here a little bit. It looks good. All right. Now to go touch up my black again. Actually, I'm gonna let that dry, and then I'm gonna do the eyes, and then we'll touch up the black lining. That's the smartest move. So here we're gonna go in for the eyes, okay? This is where we're gonna use our blue, and we're just gonna try to be really careful and make the cleanest lines that we possibly can here. So we don't have a lot of cleanup like I do in the white and black. I'm gonna learn from my mistakes here and just take a little bit more time and, and fill it in nicely. Okay, and once again, this may need a second coat, I'm not really sure. Um, I'm gonna go over this one, then I'm gonna go to the other eye, and then I'm gonna come back and put a second coat, and vice versa. Just to make it look really nice and dark and full, because sometimes whenever we paint, it's like, it makes little street marks, okay? So I'm gonna let that dry. Then I'm gonna go in this one and do the same thing. Try to be as straight and clean as possible here. Okay, just move. To the other side and give another layer. And it's probably not really that dry, so it's really not going to do much good, but it should be fine. I might even go after I touch up my black lines and give this another layer. Let's see. We shall see. Sometimes, whenever you have wet paint, and you're trying to paint over it, it, all it does is literally like pulls up the paint. It doesn't give you a nice coverage. So you have to really be careful sometimes. All right, I'm gonna leave that for a minute and I don't know if I'm gonna go back or not, I haven't decided. Um, I'm gonna go in with my small brush and I, now I'm gonna do some more touch-ups because I went over with the white. So I'm literally just going to touch up around some edges is all I'm doing now. So 
sorry if my camera is wiggling, I see it wiggling above my head. Um, yeah, I'm just going to go over here and just do some cleanup. Just like that. I'm just going to go around and just clean all these lines up from all that white that I got all over it. Trying to be as careful as I can to not go back again, do any more cleanup. <laughs> Same as this side, I'm just going to go and clean it up. Okay. Okay. Okay, up there. Okay, and now I think I'm just gonna go in a little tiny bit with the eye blue again, just to make make it more in the areas that needs more coverage. Just gonna go over that real quick. Try to can try to be really careful. Much better. Much better. I don't know if you can hear my son's music in the background. He listens to all kinds of music. Lots of old stuff. Lots of cool different music. Okay, I see a little spot I need to touch up really fast right here. Oops. Okay. And I think we're done. I think we are done. So, I hope you enjoy it. I hope you paint. I hope you share it. I hope you share your pictures with me and all that good stuff, but there it is. I hope you guys have a great day. Say so, bye.